Okay, so here's a little pro tip that can make life a little bit easier. This is my anchor rope. I had to get new ropes this year. And this is, it's actually not a new rope. I bought it from a friend of mine. It's 200 feet of 3 8 I don't know, it's a polypropylene or something, but it's a retired, I don't know what rope. I mean, you can see it's frayed a little bit, It's, but it's nice soft rope. Like that's not going to break off in your hands. Um, that's from going through a puller a little bit. Anyway, being frayed like that makes it take paint really well. So if you measure in 10 feet from both ends and you paint a two foot strip red, um, what happens is when you're pulling your anchor up, you know, you're in kind of a hurry, get a good rhythm going on, you don't end up smashing it into the side of your boat. Because when you see this come up, you know, just slow the fuck down because there's an anchor right you know 10 feet from it um, if you have a real hard uh, XLPE rope or something that won't take paint what you can do and I'll try and do this with one hand separate the strands like this and thread a piece of red rag or you know something a different color through there and you just uh you do that over like a longer section right and then you leave like a few inches sticking out both ends and it'll do the same thing so anyway that's my little little tip for the day so anyways thanks for watching guys i hope someone uh gets some use out of this video and this should save the paint or the gel coat on the side of your boat